Hello everyone, welcome back to BPO Interview Tutorials. Uh, I hope you guys are doing really well and uh, please don't miss to share, subscribe our channel. You will get views related to Six Sigma certification, Excel tips and tricks, trainers, team lead, quality, operation management, KPIs, people management. Many more videos are there in a playlist guys. Please do check and don't miss to subscribe the channel. So today we came up with the uh, concept uh, while continuing the topic of Google Data Studio. In the last video you have seen that I gave the overview about the Google Data Studio, why we are using it, what is the need of it. Okay, let's start. I'll give you the basic overview on the Data Studio tool, how it will work, how we need to capture the data, we will see it in today's video. So I hope you guys all know how to access the Google Sheet. In the previous video I already told you guys that Google Data Studio basically we will use uh, to prepare the dashboard using Google Sheet. You can use the other uh, data source as well. That's completely fine. But with contacts to uh, BPO interview tutorials or with regards to our job, we will basically use with the Google Sheet. So I just have uh, one Google Sheet with me wherein I'm considering this as my quality dashboard. You can rename this. It's up to you directly. And if you still don't know how to access the Google Sheet, uh, please check out my video you will get the information related to it and uh, you can rename the sheet also just you need to double click to the bottom you can rename it with the name of raw so you can do that as well okay it's very easy to do uh, just you need to double click on it and just mention raw simple uh, so this is just a data now let's see how to access the Google Data Studio tool or else Looker tool. First you need to go to Google and type there Google Data Studio. You will get a first link as Looker Studio Overview Google. You need to click on it. Once you click on it, you will come to this particular dashboard wherein you can add your raw data which you have prepared into the tool guys. It's very easy to do. Here you can see a few samples also like tutorial reports, uh, some marketing related dashboard. Uh, it's related to some console report many are there below you will uh, see the dashboard which you guys are preparing if you prepare any uh, the name will get reflect here if someone else have prepared and they give you the access yes you can see this here as well okay uh, own my me shared with me which means someone else have prepared your colleague have prepared the dashboard they just give you the view access or edit access you can just see the people who are working on google sheets and everything they know like uh, how to share the access how uh, the sheet is owned by me they know everything about it just basic guys so let's start uh, how to add the data in google studio so first i'll click on blank report okay i'm just clicking on blank report it will ask you the basic information that is your country i'm just mentioning here as india uh, company name you can give the demo name that's completely fine don't give your uh, company name completely here I would suggest because uh, as per the approval given by your company you can do it or else you just mention like uh, something like uh, quality reports or else you can mention as quality dashboard quality dashboard continue it will ask you that uh, would you like to receive email and tips and recommendation okay you can do select all that's completely fine continue if you do know that's completely fine guys uh okay now let's start blank report it's loading guys uh it will tell it will take few minutes yes it's it's working now uh you will get this uh, dashboard guys it's a blank dashboard as of now but we will add our google sheet here today we will see how to link the google uh, sheet with the dashboard okay so i'm just closing this as of now i'll show you see you have multiple options like add the page add the data okay view the, the the dashboard which you have prepared you can view it before that i will just rename first so untitled report I'll keep this as a quality quality dashboard i'll keep that as quality dashboard okay it's done now i will add my raw data to this google sheet this is my raw data correct i'll add to my uh, google data studio so i'll just click on add data okay 
and you will scroll this i already told you guys you can uh, as per your requirement you can use multiple data source so here you can see google ads we have google my business many many inbuilt extensions are there of the google which you guys can use but here my requirement is on google sheet you can see here google sheet guys it's easy to visible or else you can type here also that as sheets okay google sheets click here click on google sheet okay it is just asking the authorization guys so make sure you are logging to your uh, gmail address if you are working with any of the company make sure that you have taken the approval from your management that you are using the google tool uh, to prepare the dashboards don't directly use it uh, maybe you may get the escalations from the company because there are few restrictions uh, restricted site which you guys cannot use now here you will click on own by me because i prepared this raw data see you can get this uh, raw data automatically here whichever you have prepared suppose someone else have prepared the raw data and they have shared you you can use that sheet also here right now no one have shared me i'm just creating with the my sheet only okay done so here this is spreadsheet now this is worksheet worksheet in the sense raw data here if you have multiple sheets here you will get uh, your sheets name here directly okay suppose there are multiple sheets so whatever sheet data you required you can use that for your dashboard it's very easy to uh, uh, like keep your data into the tool now do all the check marks click on add it's very easy guys you can do it uh, in a very simple manner so it will take few minutes to load guys if the data is huge or heavy it may take some more time okay it is asking you are about to add the data yes add to the report it is just asking the alert to us now done so you guys can see that my raw data is already added here now we need to prepare the dashboard so guys before preparing to the dashboard i just want to uh, give you few overview here so you can see here it is a view okay it, it it will take few minutes to load the things guys just few minutes and you can give the share access also okay if you want to give share access to any of your colleague or friend you can do the same okay so uh, like suppose your colleagues also want to your manager want to access you can give the access here okay but make sure please take the approval first uh, post sharing or post starting this particular by default it will take one uh, table guys by default it will take but on on per on as per our requirement we will create a dashboard so first i will delete this because i don't need this if you just click on delete it will it will get deleted directly okay now i'll give you few overview here see guys uh, although you know that in the file menu you will get all the information about how you can share the report themes and layout uh if you want to make a copy of same dashboard you can do that if you want to download this uh in a form of pdf you can do that okay edit option is also there if you want to do paste special it, it will work very smoothly guys and if you want to view view in the sense the dashboard what you have prepared you just want to view it like how it will look like you can view here as of now nothing was added that is the reason it is showing completely blank so this is the overview on the google tool google studio tool or locker data tool guys now in the next video we will learn how to prepare the dashboard we will use few graph table slicers we will include many pages because this this is the vast concept guys we required uh, to give more time on it to understand this particular thing very thoroughly okay let's meet up to the another video wherein i will guide you guys how to prepare the dashboard i'm not going with the step by step uh, like uh, how to do some how to use the functions and all we will directly jump to the dashboard reason in the dashboard i will cover up all the points that's it guys from my side if you still have any doubt please share your comments feedback and also if you like this concept please hit on the like button and also give your comments like is it is excellent or do you require any more detail on it please please share your feedbacks and share with your friends i'm telling you guys very clearly if you have worked on this tool if you have the access of gmail in your company guys you will rock and you can create uh, amazing dashboards while rather than doing the manual dashboard works that's all guys thanks a lot thanks for watching